You wanna say hi to YouTube? Oh, your haircut looks different. Where are you looking at? Wow, you're staring straight into the distance. Kiss, kiss. Mm. All right, down you go. Hey guys, it's Kat. Welcome back to my channel. I am back yet again with another Aritzia haul. I actually picked out quite a few dresses from the summer collection, which I feel like this year there's actually a lot more dresses on the website than there has been in previous years. So this might even be a part two or part three coming soon. So please give me a thumbs up on this video if you'd like to see those ones as well. I actually feel like I have a good mix of dressy and casual dresses. So without further ado, let's get right into the haul. So I think I'm gonna start with arguably my favorite item out of the haul. It is this super cute mini dress from Wilfred. This is called the Fable Dress and it's in the color gray taupe slash multi taupe, which is basically this sort of floral pattern. There's a bunch of different colors. If you look closely, there's like all colors of the rainbow basically. And it is printed on this light taupe base and it screams summer to me, but not too loud, like a light scream. I love all of the little detailing that they made with the fabric as well as the strap. It's basically two strings and you can just tie it yourself however you want and I love that flexibility. In terms of sizing, this dress actually fits really, really, really small. So definitely get a size or even two sizes up. I ordered the size four originally and it just did not fit. And also it was way too short so I exchanged it for a six and to be honest, I could have even gone up to an eight if I wanted it to be a little bit longer. And when talking to my friends who also got this dress, it had the same sentiment. So definitely, definitely size up. But regardless, this is such a cute dress. I can't wait to wear it out in the summertime and finally take a few photos so I can post it on my Instagram because I never post on there because I never really take any photos or remember to take any photos. So there is that. We're gonna do a quick pivot here to a casual dress. This little dress is from TNA. It is called the Quartz Dress. So I saw that there was a few different variations of this type of ribbed dress online from TNA. And I picked up this one because I've had a lot of luck recently just getting things with this sort of neckline. It's very similar to the style of the Honor Tank. First off, I'm really impressed with the quality here. It is made of a thick ripped material, so it's not going to show any linings or anything like that and it's also going to cinch you just a tiny bit and it does have a little bit of stretch to it so it doesn't feel very uncomfortable or anything like that I got this in a size small and I feel like this is a really good size for me I don't think I could have gotten any smaller I'm already thinking about going back and getting other colors because compared to the other dresses that I got this is the most inexpensive item it is $58 and I just feel like I'm getting a lot of value out of this item because of its price compared to its quality quality. So sticking with the bodycon type dress theme, I also got this dress from the group by Babaton. It is called the Soft Contour Dress in the color GD Grey Taupe, which is a color that I absolutely love and I have in so many different things. My first impression of this dress is that it's actually a lot thinner than I thought it would be and it doesn't have the compression that I would think that a dress like this would have. The material here seems like it was a tank top but then they just elongated it into a dress. It just doesn't give me that like snatched feeling that I get with the TNA dress that I just showed you. So I actually don't know how I feel about this dress. I think it's going in the maybe pile for now. One thing that I do like about the dress is the length. It is longer than a mini dress and hits closer to the knee area. So overall, I do like the fit of the TNA dress a little bit more. Not that it's really comparing apples to apples, but nevertheless for $68, I expected something a lot better. So moving on to a dress that I absolutely love. This is the Wilfred Only Ruched Dress. This is in the color Classic Navy and I got it in the size small. It is this silky, satiny, beautiful slip dress with this ruching on both sides, which you can adjust on your own, depending on how asymmetrical you want the sides to be. This is definitely an evening going out special occasion dress, but because restaurants are closed for dine-in at the moment, I haven't had the opportunity to wear this dress, but I have tried it on more than 10 times at home. So there's that, but I'm super excited to finally wear it. I can see myself wearing this in the summertime and in the winter time. So I will be hanging this back in my closet, patiently waiting for the day to come. 
it will come soon. Next up, we have a pop of color in this haul. It is this cute little mini dress from Babaton. It is called the Anderson dress and it's in the color apricot ice, which is this pastel orange, which screams summertime and Miami. This color is definitely out of my comfort zone and I have to be honest, I am not tanned enough to wear this color yet, but every year in the summertime, I am always super committed in getting at least three shades darker than my current winter skin tone. When the sun finally comes out for those short two months in Canada, rest assured, I will be out there on the beach in the park tanning as much as possible. So this is more of a dress for the future more tan cat about a month from now. I do love the fit of this dress. I like the little scoop neckline here and it has a crisscross back that is adjustable with these sort of like bra straps. The material is a very thick, high quality nylon and viscose mix, which feels very luxurious on the skin, which I'm not surprised at all with the price point of $110. So this is definitely one of the more pricier items in this haul. And because of that, I'm actually a little bit hesitant about keeping it, especially because I feel like I'm too pale to wear it. So I can't even get anywhere out of it now. So I don't know, this may have to go in the maybe pile too but I love the color. Oh, this is hard. So next up, I actually have a jumpsuit here. I feel like jumpsuits are like the distant cousins of dresses. It is called the market jumpsuit. It's in the color gold gray and I got it in a size small. So usually I would prefer dresses over jumpsuits just because functionally it's a lot easier to get in and out of. Jumpsuits usually have a ton of like zippers, buttons, freaking Velcros, um, just different mechanisms that make it super complicated. However, I found this jumpsuit here, which first of all, it is in the most softest cottony material that it just feels like skin when you put it on. It just feels like, I just wanna wear it like a scarf, you know, wear it as a blanket. So the material is obviously incredible, but it is also so easy to put on and off. There's no button, no zipper whatsoever. So you kind of just wear it like pants. You just put your legs in and then pull all the way up to your shoulders. And then that's about it. So speaking of things that are a dress, but not technically a dress, I have this super long button up dress here. It is marketed as a dress, but I'm really just going to be wearing it as a cover-up or a jacket. It is called the Boyfriend Button-Up Dress. I got it in the white size extra small. It is also from Wilfred. I was really looking for a lightweight white button-up that is oversized that I can just throw on in the summertime. And I had tried on a couple of different styles across different brands in store. And this is really the one that came out on top. Because it's supposed to be worn as a dress, it's a lot longer than what a normal boyfriend fit button-up would be, which is perfect for me because I can wear it with dresses. And this is the closest to what I had envisioned for what I wanted. So I'm really glad I found it. And in terms of sizing, it does fit really oversized. So definitely go a size down. I went with the extra small and it still gives me the oversized loose boyfriend fit. So I'm really glad that I sized down. I love how the sun just decides to finally come out after I had already finished filming everything. So so that's really it, you guys. Thank you guys for tuning in to another haul. Let me know if you want to see more dresses from Aritzia or comment down below and let me know what other categories I should do. I would love to do that for you. And if you love Aritzia like I do, please check out some of the other hauls that I did on my channel. I did a bunch recently. I will link them up here and also in the description box. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because it will really, really make my day. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye.